he is going to be evaluating Joanna's speech for tonight. Thank you, then. So you started out with a question. You came out here, you asked a question. And I think that's one of the best ways to start out because that gets the audience engaged, it gets us thinking, it shows that you care about us a little bit when you're doing speech. So you gave us three scenarios, which were funny. The first, with the father-in-law about wetting the pants. <laughs> the second, of course, is about the bread and the boot. And the third one is the stuff sneaking out at night and saying, I can't see you, instead of I can't hear you. As a, somebody, Whose like whose what's it called language? See, I can't even say the phrase. <laughs> <laughs> Who has the English language as a second language? I can understand where you're coming from because I think we all suffer from that. But that's what makes it fun. The speech was going well because you had those points. During every single minute and a half, you would give us a funny twist or a funny line, and it would, it would definitely make us laugh. So you did have those in the speech. And you concluded and you tied the speech together with your youth. That's you know, all this happened when we were still young and we were still learning English. <laughs> now some of the things that I noticed and perhaps some improvements that could have been done is, and comedy is this weird thing, right? I was watching a Dave Chappelle episode where he was interviewing and the person asked him, what are your techniques in comedy? And he said, I don't have any techniques. It's a language. Comedy is a language of its own. Man, I wish I could learn that language myself. But one thing that would have been nice for us is you talked a little bit quickly in between your funny parts so you talked for about a minute and a half before you got to that climax point and then we lost the tension. If you would have built up a bit more pausing in between you could have raised the tension of the audience and we would have been a little bit more focused on what you were saying. So slow down, slow down your speech and put more pausing inside. And maybe one or two little humorous breaks in between because that would have uh, having us stay on hold for about a minute and a half before we left might be just a little bit too long. Another thing is, you, you did use some of your body language when you turned around and said, I can't hear you. But other than that, you, should, you, you just almost stayed next to the podium. It would have been nice because I know you used body language so well in your other speeches. It would have been nice if you used it a little bit more with the boot. Said, hey, there's, there's the boot. <laughs> so that would have been really great. And as far as constructive criticism, that's all I have. Overall, I laughed. I think the audience had a great time listening to your speech. So thank you very much. We look forward to your next speech. Thank you.